so to start off, I'm very, very sorry that I haven't posted for seven freaking weeks. What the heck? I was originally going to do one gigantic punishment, but I couldn't think of anything horrible enough to do for one gigantic punishment. And so I'm just going to do seven punishments. I currently only have, like, three picked out. So if you have any suggestions, just leave them in the comments of this video or something, and maybe I'll do them. But I may or may not do a punishment today, because the punishment I had in mind, we don't have in my house, but I can go buy it, but I have to actually go there, and my parents don't necessarily like taking me places to buy things. And if it isn't, I'm sorry, but I will do one next week, I promise. I promise. This week, because it's Halloween, we decided to do all of our vlogs in our costumes, and my costume is a socially awkward teenage vlogger, which, as you can see, I've got my all-time low t-shirt, and as you can't see, I've got on sweatpants. I'm all ready for vlogging. We're going to do the Tumblr accent challenge this week. I realize this isn't Tumblr, but you know what? Close enough. What is your name and your username? My name is Molly, and my username on YouTube is Invisible Lighter. Where are you from? I am from Minnesota. Pronounce the following words. Aunt, roof, root, theater, iron, salmon, caramel, fire, water, New Orleans, pecan, both, again, probably, Alabama, lawyer, coupon, mayonnaise, pajamas, cot, naturally, aluminum, gift, Tumblr, Cracker Jack, Doorknob, Envelope, and G-P-O-Y. What is it called when you throw toilet paper out of house? It's called TP. What is a bubbly carbonated drink called? Pop. What do you call your gym shoes? Tennis shoes. What do you call your grandparents? Grandma and Grandpa. What do you call the wheeled contraption in which you get carry groceries at the supermarket? A shopping cart. What is the thing you change the TV channel with? It's a remote. Choose a book and read a passage from it. I'm going to read a passage from The Lightning Thief. It's good. Look, I didn't want to be a half-blood. If you're reading this because you think you might be one, my advice is close this book right now. Believe whatever lie you told your mom or dad told you about, about your birth and try to lead a normal life. Being a half-blood is dangerous. It's scary. Most of the time it gets you killed in painful, nasty ways. If you're a normal kid reading this book because you think it's fiction, great. Read on. I envy you for being able to believe that none of this ever happened. But if you recognize yourself in these pages, if you feel something stirring inside, stop reading immediately. You might be one of us. And once you know that, it only it's only a matter of time before they sense it too, and they'll come for you. Don't say I didn't warn you. Do you think you have an accent? It's only with certain words that I think I have an accent, but most of the time, no. Would you rather be a wizard or a vampire? Who does not want to go to freaking Hogwarts? Of course a wizard. Do you know anyone on YouTube in real life? My friend Lauren, and she has a bazillion channels. I know her. That, that's about it. End this by saying any three words you choose. Nitwit, Frankenstein, Clams. I'll see everyone next week. Bye.